Harper and Madison's Zoo Adventure. One day, Harper and Madison went to the zoo. It was a sunny, beautiful day and a great day to see the animals. Madison got some ice cream and Harper enjoyed some cotton candy. They saw tons of cool animals at the zoo, like the gorillas and the zebras and some great big bears. It was a long, fun day for Harper and Madison at the zoo, and it was getting late. They decided to see the dolphins one last time before the zoo closed. Harper and Madison watched the amazing dolphins swim and play. They watched and watched, and before they knew it, the zoo was closed and they were trapped inside. We need to get out of the zoo. Harper and Madison said to the dolphins. One playful dolphin swam to the kids and said he could help them get out of the zoo. There was an opening in the roof above the dolphin pool. Harper and Madison rode the dolphins as they jumped up into the air. From the roof, Harper and Madison climbed down into the monkey pit. The monkeys were happy to see them and gave them each a banana to eat. Can you help us get out of the zoo? A monkey named Monty said he could help. Monty, Harper, and Madison climbed up a tree and swung to the top of the monkey pit. On the other side of the monkey pit was a rock climbing wall. Harper and Madison climbed carefully down the wall right into the lion's den. Two huge lions came chasing after Harper and Madison. I don't think these lions are going to help us get out of the zoo, Harper said to Madison. The lions were getting closer to Harper and Madison. Luckily, a group of monkeys above began to throw banana peels at the charging lions. The lions slipped on the banana peels and crashed into each other. Harper and Madison safely reached the other side of the lion's den. Harper and Madison landed in a swamp area. The two started to hop from rock to rock to get to the other side. But the rocks were not rocks at all. They were alligators. I definitely don't think these alligators will help us get out of the zoo, Madison said to Harper as they bounced to the other side of the swamp. Luckily, a long-necked giraffe was looking over the wall. He dropped his head down, and Harper and Madison jumped onto his neck, safe at last from the hungry alligators. We need help getting out of the zoo, Harper and Madison told the giraffe. The giraffe said that the elephants could help them get out of the zoo. The two gigantic elephants made a swing out of their trunks and swung Harper and Madison over the wall. Harper and Madison landed safely on a bed of hay. Next to the pile of hay was the exit gate. Harper and Madison were out of the zoo, free at last. They could not have done it without their animal friends. Harper, try one of our other personalized books at firsttimebooks.com.